Hello ladies and gents, DJ Ranger back in the place once again with an R's Bar Predictor Roundup Show for Derby v QPR which was played Wednesday the 4th of November 2020 at Pride Park Stadium, live on Sky 745 kickoff. Um, as, as you know yourself ladies and gents, the game finished 1-0 to QPR with a late late goal by McCauley Bond in the 88th minute. Um, we seem to like scoring late late goals against Derby don't we? Well, two times now obviously. Uh, the other one was a bigger, bigger game, obviously, of course, as you know. Um, yeah, managed to grind out the win. Um, game itself wasn't a great spectacle. Overall, I thought, tell both sides are down at the table for the wrong end of the reason, you know, struggling to score goals defensively, possibly. But tonight, we kind of looked okay at the back from a QPR point of view. Derby kind of, I think, were more on the counter-attack in the first half, but in the second half, they the up tempo, the pace of, with their gameplay a bit more. Lucky for us, we we stuck in, defended well, and managed to score that vital goal um, from McCauley Bond with a good cross from Rob Dickey, who eventually got mad a match. Um, he put a challenge in, which I, I thought at first he did foul the guy, but from the seeing the replays, he did win the ball. So hence why the ref didn't give the free kick, and lucky for us created the goal. Uh, maybe he should have scored as well from his chance, but then there was a few chances in the first half and in the second half as well. Um, you know, clearly, uh, Dykes' his header should have done better for, in QPR's eyes. The keeper made a good save. Chair had a shot which took a deflection. Now, whether it's goal bound, I'm not sure. Uh, I think Adoma may have had a chance. We had some other shots from Chair again. And I think Kane had a couple of shots and maybe Bright. Derby had a few themselves, had a couple of offsides. Um, Yazik or Waziak had a chance, which Deng saved, went out for a corner. And obviously Rooney had a chance as well, a, quite a close chance, which took a deflection, went out for a corner as well. I think they had some shots some which similar to ours, which went wide, luckily for us. Um, and then, as I said, we managed to get the vital goal through Bond with a header late on the game in about the 88th minute. Um, but for the predictions, ladies and gents, YouTube, Bradley Dewin done one all, and Samuel Benesiglio done one nil to QPR. So well done, Samuel. Give yourself a pat on the back for predicting the score incorrect. Facebook, we had Bradley Hunt done one nil at QPR. Roger DeCosta done two one to QPR. John Reed done one all draw. Shu Keo done three all draw. Tom Red done eight nil at QPR. Kieran Berry done three two to QPR. Neil Mosley done one all draw. Uh, Richard Arden, the legend Butler, done two one to QPR. Mick Crawford's done two one to QPR. James Constable done four one to QPR. And Del Bellwood done two one to QPR. And on from the Facebook predictors, the only one who got score line correct was Bradley Hunt. So Bradley as well, give yourself a tap on the back, mate. Well done for predicting the score line correct. Um, where it did finish, Derby nil, QPR one. Wednesday, the 4th of November 2020, 7.45 kickoff, live on Sky, ladies and gents. We actually won on Sky again. Uh, that's for myself, DJ Ranger, with an R's bar, the roundup show for Darwin v QPR, Wednesday, 4th of November 2020. I'm out of here. Come on, you R's.